I wanted to do this video a little bit about frost. This is something that all of us gardeners, at least in the north, have uh, issues with. If you go to Wikipedia, the definition of frost is the solid deposition of water vapor from saturated air. It is formed when solid surfaces are cooled to below the dew point of the adjacent air as well as below the freezing point of water. Frost crystal size differ depending on time and water vapor available. Most frost is usually translucent in appearance. There may be many types of frost, such as radiation and window frost. Frost causes economic damage when it destroys plants and hanging fruits. Well, this is what we're going to focus on in our case. I don't need to go into every type of frost, like the kind that you wake up and see on your window in the winter time as such. The um, frost I just wanted to touch on here, of course, is for us gardeners. And I have a few tips that might help to prevent frost damage when it's coming, if you know there's going to be a frost. Um, first of all, I guess I would like to say there's two reasons that I know of as to why the frost damages the actual plants themselves. According to Wikipedia, the ice crystals actually puncture holes inside the plant and that causes the damage. The other theory that I've heard is when the sun comes up, it actually tends to it increases its power through the frost and it burns the plant. Kind of like you might say, a, maybe like a magnifying glass. So having said that, what about some methods we can use to prevent frost? Well, some of the things that have worked for us, floating row cover cloth that we've used, and that presents it, prevents the frost by trapping in the heat from the ground um, to keep the frost and ice crystals from forming on the plants. I've also heard that you can water them throughout the night to keep the water from keeping the ice crystals from forming on it. And of course the best thing to do is to try to avoid planting by what's called a frost date. Each individual area that you live in will have a different frost date. Our frost date where we are is May 24th. Now we happen to be in a valley and for some reason valleys seem to get a lot more frost than the top does depending on your situation mostly probably because of the moisture buildup. So many mornings when they have not called for frost, we have actually got frost at our place, as you see today in this footage. And if for any reason you miss the fact that there's going to be frost and you happen to be up before the sun is, if you water the plants really well, you could probably prevent the damage. We've never actually tried this ourselves as we've tried to do more preventative measures so that's just a quick video, a little bit about frost. The Wikipedia link is in the sidebar, or whatever used to be the sidebar, whatever it is now. So in the meantime, thanks very much for watching, and have a good gardening season.